They've put aside 16 years of absolute commitment to our child and have taken away our child based on the lie that a person can be born in the wrong body. We want our daughter back home. The story is truly a nightmare. Swiss authorities have taken our child, our daughter, who's 16 years old. We, as parents, are facing an alliance between the school, the Swiss Child Protection Agency, the Swiss Hospital in Geneva, and we feel powerless. About three years ago, coming out of the pandemic, our daughter informed us that she was a boy. We understood that she was going through a difficult period in her life. We agreed to seek medical advice. When we first went to the Geneva Hospital, the nurse showed her a gender unicorn, and it was based on this gender unicorn that we were instructed by the hospital to begin treating her as a boy. We were told she needed puberty blockers. The school got involved. Everyone at the school, the teachers, the administrators, started to call our daughter a male name. We were very clear with the school that we did not believe that it was up to the school to socially transition our daughter. We learned that this school psychologist was getting in and was feeding my daughter with materials putting her in contact with uh, Le Refuge. Le Refuge is a transgender advocacy organization and has taken our daughter down the path of believing that she's a boy in a girl's body. Eventually, the Swiss Child Protection Agency with the school support, brought a case against us in the Swiss court system. And that has meant for us many sleepless nights, a lot of deep pain, and a sense of hopelessness. A school, a trans activist organization and a public hospital together with the child welfare agencies of the canton of Geneva have socially transitioned a child against the advice of medical professionals and also against the express will of the parents. Of course the parents have more than one word to say concerning very important decisions with the potential impacts on the whole life of their child. No human being is born in the wrong body. Taking an adolescent, telling him or her that he or she is born in the wrong body is cruel. We want our daughter back home. Just uh, we love her and we miss her. My son, he feels his sister is missing. He has written several letters but we haven't heard back from her. So it's really out of this pain and this desperation that we have decided there's really no other option but to speak up. The Swiss government essentially took our daughter away from us. Our daughter now lives in a government home. Our access to her is regulated by the Swiss government. We don't want to see other families in this situation. There's no one else beyond parents who will ever bring and cultivate the love that the children need to be the best they can be, to go on and 
not only fulfill their dreams, but to create their own families in the future.